Hello everyone, it's Spike to this side and welcome back to a new tutorial. And in this tutorial, we are going to learn how to unhash passwords. Now let's see. I have a password list, okay, uh, basically a table which is dumped from a certain website. And it has username, password, permission, and then two date times with last insert or last update. Okay. Uh, I can read the username. Looks good. Uh, you can see uh, this is admin and it has permission turned on. Which means this is actually the admin. The only problem is the password is hashed. So what we have to do, we have to unhash this pa password if in order to, if you want to check if this is correct or not, or if you want to log into the website or the tool from where we have done this. Okay. So there are basically two steps. First, identify uh, what kind of hash this is, and second, try to enhance the hash. So for that, you can use tools as well, or you can use online websites. We'll be simply using online website. So let's just go to the first step, and that is uh, how to identify what kind of hash this is. So for this, it's actually very easy. You can just open any. Uh, Tool like ChatGPT, Gemini, or DeepSeek. Uh, let's try with DeepSeek. I'll just type uh, find out what kind of as this is or help me decrypt it. Okay. And just paste your has. I know this may not be able to decrypt it, but it will tell me what kind of hash this is. So see, this is this says the hash is 40 characters long, which is consistent with SHA1 or RIPE MD160. So given its structure, it is most likely SHA1 hash. So it says that this is a SHA1 hash. Check if it is known as on these uh, websites, online databases. So it is giving also giving certain websites where you can check if this is uh SHA1 or not. So you can just try to open this or you can use tools like John the Ripper or Hascat, which we already have made tutorials in this series. Okay, so you can try Hascat like this, but we have you have to pass a word list. Okay. Yes, uh, and there are a few more things which is written like here, but uh our first task is completed that we have identified what kind of hash this is SHA1. Okay. Let, then all you have to do is you have to type SHA1 has decrypt online. You can also try this three website that uh, it has uh, mentioned here. Has killer crack station of hashes or you can just use anyone from these. Okay, see there are a bunch of appearing uh, here. Uh, the one I'm interested uh, in currently is this. MD5 has seen. Okay. So let's try MD5 has seen. Dot net. Uh, here's the direct link. We can just open it for the SHA1 has. So it's opening like this. It's, it has two things calculate SHA1 has from text or reverse SHA1 decoder. So we want to reverse it. Okay. So let's just paste our hash and try to decode. So it's saying decrypting, please wait. This may take a few minutes. So let's just wait and see if it is able to uh, dehash it or unhash it. You can see there are a bunch of uh, things here. I want to show you for in this website. But let's see if we are getting the unhashed value or not. Uh, you can try any website of your choice. It doesn't matter once you identify the hash and try multiple websites. Okay. So it successfully unhashed it. It says reward hash values in Brio Hotel 1234 star. Now, how can we check if it is actually uh, or not? So let's just go to the hash unhash section and paste the new one. MD Hotel 1234. And I'll select uh, from here SH1. You can see there are a bunch of hashing techniques. Ripe MD1 was also there, which was mentioned in DeepSeek. So SHA1, I'll select. 
and then I'll try to calculate hash. Let's wait and let's see what's the hash for this. Okay, so it's giving MD5 hash value, but if I scroll down below, see inside the table, this is giving me the hash value in all these formats MD2, MD4, MD5, SHA1, uh, SHA2, 24, 256, 384, write MD, Whirlpool, Snap2. So there are a bunch of hashes, okay, which you can get here. You can just scroll down and check for any, okay. So well, ours is this one e seven four two. Let me copy and just verify. Or let me just paste here. You can see this is matching. Okay, so it means we have successfully amassed Embraer Hotel one two three four. You can just copy this and paste there, and you will also find the unhashed value of this. I hope it works for you. So this is it for this tutorial, guys. Uh, let's meet in the next tutorial. Thank you.